Hi everyone. In this video, I would like to show you how to add additional rows to swim lanes. There are actually three different methods. Method one is drag and drop. So all you need to do is look for this swim lane icon and then just drag and drop. What's very important is when you drop that time, make sure that you see this orange line before you drop. If you don't see the orange line and you anyhow drop, you will come up with another swim lane, which is definitely not what you want. So let's undo this. Okay, so again, when you drag and you drop, make sure that you see this orange line first before you drop. Sometimes the orange line will take one to two seconds. Just make sure that you wait for that orange line to appear before you drop. Let me show you the second method to add a new row. All you need to do is right click on any of the row and you will see this option insert swim lane before or after. So if you click this insert swim lane after, you will get a new row right below it. So now let me show you method 3. Click on this cross functional flowchart menu up here. Click on the first button called swim lane and it will add a new row to the swim lane. So these are the three different methods of adding new rows to a swim lane. Hope you find this video useful. Thank you for watching. If you want to know more about Visual, please continue to encourage me in the comments below. I look forward to that. Yes, please click the like or subscribe button if you find this video useful. See you in the next video.